This is how it begins. Kathy Hodds had a hard childhood. Her parents divorced when she was eight. This was especially difficult on her because she was close to her father. When she was in middle school, a close friend died from a heart condition. She almost always spoke of feelings or premonitions that she would never live to be 16. She and her family moved to a residential apartment complex in Las Vegas in order to help her get her mind off of her fears. She made several friends and seemed to adjust well, until her 16th birthday approached. Kathy once again feared that she was going to die. She spent all of her time in her room and refused to leave the house. On the morning of her 16th birthday, however, she was surprised and relieved to realize that she was still alive. She seemed to have overcome her fears, confiding in her family that the premonitions were unfounded, and began living a more normal teenage life. She started to spend more time with her friends and began to wear makeup. She developed an interest in beauty products, and had started pursuing a career as a beautician. She even planned to open her own hair salon called Cod's Cuts. However, she vanished without explanation on the night of July 23, 1987. That night, she was reading a book in her room. At 11 p.m., she told her mother Vivian that she was taking a quick trip to the nearby supermarket to purchase another book. The store was just a couple of blocks away. Vivian believed that she would walk to the store with friends in their apartment complex, as she normally did. However, none were around that night, so Kathy went alone. At around 3 a.m., Vivian awoke from a sound sleep. She felt that she had been hit on the head. Afterwards, she had a peaceful feeling and felt that it was over. At the time, she did not understand the meaning of the experience. The next morning, Vivian discussed this is the story. See you in another video.